Not only is Thank You Next by Ariana Grande an awesome song, the video is like watching four of our favorite guilty pleasure movies at once. Did you catch all the clues in the video hinting at her upcoming songs? If not, don't worry, we'll break them down and give you some insight on what to expect from her upcoming album. Shortly after releasing her album Sweetener, Ariana Grande announced she was already working on a new album. Naturally, fans immediately wanted to know what it would be about and if there would be any scandalous content. But Grande described the album Thank You Next on social media as containing no drags, no shade, just love, gratitude, acceptance, honesty, forgiveness, and growth. It seems as though this album is going to be full of positivity, and we are totally here for that. One fan asked if there would be a track about empowerment, to which Grande replied, exactly, a new chapter. Gratitude, growth, embracing our path bumps, and all. Thank you, next. She also revealed there will be no collaborations on this album, it will be just Ariana Grande. This leads many of us to suspect this will be a particularly personal album and contain many references to Grande's life. But don't be fooled by all of the upbeat rhythms Grande assures us will be included in Thank You Next. She claims some of the song lyrics will be unexpectedly somber, despite how they sound. The album represents a rather sad chapter in Grande's life and her music reflects it. Music that you can dance to but still makes you think. Sign us up. Listening to Ariana Grande music is great on its own, but here at The Taco, we are always looking for hidden clues about her upcoming projects. And we don't have to search too hard because Grande is great about peppering her songs, social media, and music videos with tantalizing hints. Like pretty much everyone else in the world, we were blown away with the awesome video for Thank You Next and noticed some things which really stuck out to us. The video paid tribute to many of Grande's favorite movies, one of which is Legally Blonde, starring Reese Witherspoon. When Grande drove her Porsche, we realized it had a vanity license plate reading Seven Rings. If you're an observant Ariana Grande fan, this phrase might just look familiar to you. On her Instagram, Instagram account Grande posted a screenshot from the Thank You Next music video and captioned it, Y'all like this instrumental at the beginning, along with seven ring emojis. You don't have to be Sherlock Holmes to figure this one out. It seems as though the brief instrumentals at the beginning of Thank You Next are actually a sneak preview for her upcoming song, Seven Rings. If you also meticulously deconstructed the music video for her song, Breathe In, you probably noticed the train schedule was actually a track list for her upcoming album, and listed among the various song titles was Seven Rings. We might have even gotten some insight about what the song is about. Fans spotted Ariana Grande wearing what looks like an engagement ring, despite publicly calling off her engagement to Pete Davidson. Instead, it seems as though the ring is a symbol of friendship, since many of her pals have been spotted wearing identical rings. During Thank You Next, Grande sings about spending more time with her friends and improving her relationship with herself. It's possible that these rings are the seven rings in the song, which will be about the power of friendship. According to Grande, she and her friends bought their rings while indulging in some retail therapy one day at Tiffany & Co. The girls were sipping on some champagne, which ended up with them getting a little tipsy and coming up with a great idea. After, Grande and her friends headed back to the recording studio and presented everyone with a shiny diamond ring. This inspired some deep feelings of friendship and a new song. In addition to Legally Blonde, we also saw Grande pay tribute to the classic movie Mean Girls in the music video for Thank You Next. In the original movie, the character Regina George wears a shirt reading a little bit dramatic, but in the music video, Grande wears a shirt that reads a little bit neat. This would be easy to pass off as a joke, but we have seen Grande use the word needy before. It also appeared on the track list featured in the video, Breathe In, and we're guessing it's more than a coincidence. We fully expect to see both needy and seven rings on the album, Thank You Next. Like most musical artists, Ariana Grande often finds inspiration for her music in her real-life events. The past year has been particularly difficult for the singer, as she is dealing with a broken engagement and the loss of Mac Miller. Grande and Miller were deeply in love with one another, but eventually Grande could no longer cope with his addiction problems. Sadly, he lost his fight with addiction and passed away. Although they had broken up, it was clear these two still cared for each other. Miller and Grande had remained friends, and she was devastated by his passing. During the song Thank You Next, she mentions him in the lyrics, but doesn't show his picture in her burn book, where she shows photos of her other exes. When questioned about it, Grande says that Miller isn't in her book because his presence is still with her to this day. So we don't think it's reading too much into things to think her relationship with Miller may have been an inspiration for at least one song on her upcoming Thank You Next album. But while Grande might be able to control what she posts about her breakups, that doesn't mean her exes don't have things to say as well. Pete Davidson is a huge part of the music video Thank You Next, and although many exes are mentioned, there's no doubt that he occupies the most time in the video. He's made many jokes about his relationship with Grande on Saturday Night Live, and some sources claim she isn't happy about it. When they were engaged, she joked about getting a prenuptial agreement to ensure that she doesn't take half of his shoes when the pair split up. He also made a joke about replacing her birth control 
blow with Tic Tacs in order to get her to stay with him, and you can imagine how well that one went over with fans. After Grande and Davidson did actually break up, the jokes kept coming, with him poking fun of their brief and broken engagement. Although she finds traditional forms of therapy beneficial, she also admits she finds comfort in singing about her feelings, and that in the aftermath of Miller's death, she threw herself into creating music and recording the album Thank You Next. During an interview with Billboard, she revealed that at least one song on the album will be about Mac Miller, and we can't wait to hear it. Now let's talk about that track list we spotted in the music video for Grande's song Breathe In. The majority of the video takes place in a train station, and the train schedule seems to show a set list with some recognizable song titles. Of course, we have Thank You Next, the titular track to Grande's upcoming album. We also see Needy and Seven Rings, as we mentioned earlier, but there are many other potential songs listed. These include Makeup, NASA, Ghostin, Remember, and Imagine. We wouldn't be at all surprised to learn this is the full set list for her upcoming Thank You Next album. The music video for Thank You Next may have also confirmed that Imagine will be a track on the new album. During one scene in the music video, we see a poster decorating the hallway which reads, Live the life you've imagined. Naturally, many fans consider this confirmation that Imagine will indeed be an upcoming song. When one fan tweeted talk about Imagine, Grande responded, I would really like you to hear that next. Some believe this is a hint that the song Imagine will be the next single she releases. We can only hope. Grande also mentioned some songwriters and producers who are allegedly helping her with Thank You Next, including Cadence, Victoria Monet, Taylor Parks, Tommy Brown, Scooty, and Mikey from Social House. While speaking about the hit song Thank You Next, Grande admits she had no idea the song would be as successful as it has been. She claimed that she and her friends were enjoying some drinks in the studio one evening while going through a particularly rough period. Usually this kind of thing just ends in a hangover for the rest of us, but something much better happened during this hangout session. She ended up writing Thank You Next during this evening and says the song ended up meaning a lot to her because she made it with her friends by her side. While the music video has gone on to become a smash hit, Grande confesses there were a few more films she would have liked to include. She selected movies featuring a main character who goes through a traumatic breakup and then becomes a better version of themselves. These movies are Mean Girls, 13 Going on 30, Legally Blonde, and Bring It On. Went along with the song, but Grande wishes she could have included the films Crossroads and Girl Interrupted. They rank among her favorite films, but she just couldn't work them into the music video. While we're all excited to listen to the album Thank You Next, many of us are also looking forward to Grande's next big music tour. In October 2018, she announced that her Sweetener World Tour will be a combination of her albums Sweetener and Thank You Next. If you're hoping to get tickets, the tour starts in March of 2019, so you'd better hurry. And with this album, Grande claims she's taking more control than ever over her musical career. Usually, she adheres to the music industry's standards about releasing songs and information, but with Thank You Next, she refused to go by anyone's schedule but her own. Her management team stressed over selecting the perfect date to release the album's titular track, but Grande simply couldn't wait to share it with her fans. She didn't have the patience to put up with constant promotion, so other than some social media hints beforehand, she released it to the public as soon as possible. But if you're wondering how the ex-boyfriend she mentioned in the song felt when the song was released, don't worry. Grande explained that they all received a sneak peek beforehand to ensure nobody would be blindsided by her shoutouts. In fact, the media coverage around her breakups was part of the reason she had been in such a hurry to release her new music. It seems as though Grande is over the media's obsession with her relationship with Pete Davidson. No and only wants to talk about it on her own terms from now on. It seems as though Grande's experiment with Thank You Next has been a massive success. Within its first 24 hours of premiering on YouTube, it shattered previous music video records as fans watched it 55.4 million times. The previous record belonged to K-pop group BTS, whose video Idol received 45.9 million views within 24 hours when it premiered in August. According to Grande, the point of this little experiment was to take back her narrative and express how she's feeling. She was tired of letting the media control her story, so she wanted to be the one that was in charge. And clearly, this gal knows what she's doing because the hype for the Thank You Next album couldn't be higher, considering the success of the music video. Grande claims this proves the more honest she is and the less care she gives to the outside sources, better things are in the end. Although we're excited to listen to the album Thank You Next, we know it's just the beginning of what Ariana Grande has in store. The singer always seems to be working hard on something or another, and she stated that she feels she's only just now scratching the surface of what she can be as an artist. Her goal is to keep on practicing and growing as both a person and a singer. Grande never wants to be lazy. She always wants to be working on the next big thing, and we can't wait to see what that will be. And when this singer sets her mind to something, she gets it done in record time. She claims that the entirety of Thank You Next was written in about a week and recorded in two. It took some time to polish everything and get it ready for the album, but according to Grande, it was the result of feminine energy and champagne, and laughter and music and crying. It definitely sounds like Ariana Grande fans have a lot to look forward to. 
Are you excited to hear Ariana Grande's new album, Thank You Next? Make sure to share your predictions with us in the comment section and then click on the subscribe button for more great videos from us here at The Taco. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again next time.